A very good afternoon and a warm welcome to the beautiful city of Bahdar with the beautiful Lake Tana in the backdrop. As your World of Champions goes live in Northwestern Ethiopia on March the 26th of the 2021-2022 Bet King Ethiopia Premier League. As the current table toppers St. George battles out with the host Bahidar in a match that has huge implications for both sides. Maul Yose, Maul Yose, Maul Yose with a long one! Good save coming in from Charles Rukwago. Maul Yose, that's a distance of about 40 yards. It looks like Charles Rukwago is already off his line and with the fresh assault, he's rasping. He could have gone in. Aida Sherefa. Well, he loses it out of Maluli. Maul Yose! Maluli Yose, the import from Ghana. At a distance that we qualify for be about 25 yards. Unleashes one that finds a chance to quaggle the Ugandan international goalkeeper. Napping. Moving up for with Mahulio Say in the prime position again. Mahulio Say with a good shot. Again this time round. Not his favorite foot, but that run on the right hand side by Ali Suleiman just giving Mahulio Say an opportunity to be able at least to strike on this one. Yes, his positioning. He doesn't fear going. Into, into the center of defenders. He's breathing from both cylinders today. Mahul say with another attempt. Again, Cherine Kuksa in a prime position. Fasid Gabriel Mikhail is out of his way. And it's a big push in there. And it's a penalty. It is a penalty. Ali Suleiman, after assisting Mahul say to get that shot in, comes back to try and help out in the defense at, at the point where you thought that St. George were in possession of the ball. That should be Chernet Kuksa. Ali Suleiman pumps him off the ball, but that is questionable. Big question here is what was Fossil Gabriel Mikhail doing? He's already left for the cutters here. Here it is. Ali Suleiman not going for the ball. Bumps into Chernet Kuksa and gives St. George a lifeline. It was definitely, it was definitely deliberate. And Aida Sherefa, who has been accorded the, the opportunity to try at least and bring St. George back, picks the right spot. He goes in. He knows that uh, goalkeeper Fasi Gabriel Mikhail is going to make that one little step. And he blasts the ball into the net to score his third goal of the campaign and tie this game. Trying to find Maul Yose. Maul Yose! Maul Yose! What a shot! Technically correct. This man, oh yes, he's breathing from both cylinders this afternoon. He's been there, he's done that so far in the first half. And again, he was looking for the bottom corner. To Dean Jamal, trying to clear the ball, but he puts the ball right in the path of Abel Yaleo. And a good run there, Amanuel. Amanuel, Gabriel Mikhail, don't you forget the man who gave the assists to Shemeles Bekele to beat Ethiopia in the second goal. And trust you me, Yes, they won against Egypt. That is Emmanuel. Kenan, Kenan, Kenan to Gabriel Mik Mikhail. A steel ball in play here. Emide with a good cross coming in and it's proper control. It's Makna! Kenan Markne follows to his credit. With the keeper not being able at least to read that movement. It's a good cross from Suleiman Hemide. Just see how the cross comes in. Keeper comes out of his line. And where was he going, that goalkeeper? He made the most, the most basic mistake. He travels and, and never is never able to touch that ball. Again, it's missed by everyone and it runs into the feet of Dilma de Sasa. And again, another big mistake. Another big mistake coming in from St. George. And I think that is uh, Suleiman Hemide. Gilman de Sasa going down. That is Abel Yaleo. Yes, Gilman de Sasa was on his way. And that was that was a bit too late. It's for Mahuli Ose, the Ghanaian import, makes it right. Yes, he knows exactly where he was going to place it. It has ended up here at the Bahadar International Stadium with St. George tying it out 2-2 against Bahadar.